So guys, I've been looking at a bunch of stuff on the internet about Sony and EA, and EA didn't show up at Sony's press conference at all, and it's kind of seeming like maybe they were pushing for the DRM that Microsoft has now established in their console, and Nintendo has not established in their console, as well as Sony has not established it in their console. They have the same stuff as last gen, with uh, Sony straight out went and said, that, hey guys, instead of doing what Xbox One is doing, we're doing the same stuff, PS3, sell your games whenever, don't have to check online to play your offline games, or anything like that. Your game, your console can play games whenever you want, if you're on the internet or not, and that's obviously the same policy with the Wii U and the 360, but the Xbox One is the one that's like, hey, no, we aren't going to do that. We have a bunch of DRM that isn't going to let you do that and it makes you think EA does has nothing to do with it seems so anyway so far I know they have nothing to do with Nintendo maybe not with Sony but they showed off some stuff at Microsoft's thing and Microsoft is all about DRM and EA in the past and right now is all about DRM I don't know why they like DRM but that's a big thing with EA they like DRM they like making a bunch of money and uh, continuing to make a bunch of money off of stuff that they already had. They obviously no one likes piracy or, or you know anything of that sort. No one does, but that doesn't mean you should have to stoop to the levels that Microsoft has with their console. I'm thinking EA pushed for that on Microsoft and might be making some sweet behind the scenes kind of uh, deal with them. Maybe I don't know if I'm just jumping to conclusions here or what, but I mean, EA wasn't at Sony's, and they weren't at Nintendo's, they weren't Microsoft's, and then of course they were at their own, but you think, maybe something's going on behind the scenes, EA has a big part in this, maybe, I mean, EA is a pretty big company, and I could see them swaying Microsoft's opinion on their console development, and making them have a bunch of DRM on their console, I mean, they have a ton of good games, well-selling games. There's there's a big difference between good games and well-selling games, of course. I'm sure everyone knows that. Uh, plenty of opinions differ upon that. But anyway, there's a lot of money that can be made with from EA for Microsoft, and they recognize that, I'm sure, which is why they have allowed them to make games on their console. Everybody realizes that there's a lot of money to be made from EA, but question is whether or not you want to put up with their DRM stuff that they want to have on the console or, and negotiate with them. I mean, Steam's already kicked them out. Nintendo, they already didn't do anything. Maybe Sony isn't going to be doing anything with EA? I have no idea. Um, tell me, guys, what you think in the comments below. Even if not that, do you think that there's going to be some big uh, dispute between them? I don't know. I, I think there might be something. It seems that way. I have no idea, of course, but... Tell me what you guys think. I'll be seeing you. Bye.